Okay guys, hope you do that warm up with me. We are gonna start with the workout and we're gonna start basic, marching. Here we go. Now, uh, if you're, if you're, if you're uh, new, march is, you know, don't try to keep up with me if you're new, okay? You can just do whatever you, um, what your body says. You wanna challenge your body, but you don't wanna, if you overdo it today, you won't be able to work out for another week or two, okay? So you wanna do it right. So we're just marching. March, um, we're gonna take a wide march. So go out, out, in, in, out. So we're switching legs. I've done this before. Out, out, in, in. So it's really left, right, left, tap. Right, left, right, tap. If you can't, or we're the opposite direction. So we're mirroring each other. If you can't do this, keep the march. Please don't give up. Don't get just, don't get discouraged. Okay. Now, if you've got this, just speed it up. This is just getting low pump. Legs warmed up better, and then we're going to add on. So it's left, right, left, tap for you guys. So I'm doing opposite. Left, right, left, tap. All right. Now, if you're really new, just take it. You don't have to bend down. Just do it up here. But if you really want to get into it and start to activate those thighs, but watch your knee, we are going to bend a little bit, okay? So this is getting into the thighs. Watch your knees. Keep your abs tight. That's it. I have to remember my, remind myself all the time to keep my abs tight. Because I just want to let that belly hang. <laughs> Whoops. Two more. You feeling it yet? All right, march it out. Back to the beginning. It's a long one, you sorry. All right, so we go up and down. So up and down. We need to really get into these shoulders a little bit more. If you're really new, this might be a workout for you. I mean, I've been breathing. I'm trying to get... That's a good thing. Don't stop when you start sweating. That's what you want. Okay, we're going to add an intensity. Just a little bit. We're going to add some knee. Knee, step, step, step. Knee, step, step, step. Knee, no arms yet. Knee, step, step. Now, if this is hard, just do step to the knee. There's no right or wrong. You do not have to be doing this exact move. But when you do bring the knee up, make sure your stomach is tight. Because this is going to, you're going to feel this in your lower back. And those of you who have low back issues might need to take it down and just go like this. Or when you feel the pull, stop. Okay. If you want to add arms, here we go. It's pull. Bring it up. Pull. Three. Now adding these arms is going to bring the intensity up. Knee. Knees. Step, step, step. Knee. One, two, three. Knee. One, two, three. Knee. I'm starting to feel this, guys. So three, take it back to the march when you need to. We're going to do four more of these if you can. Remember, the abs are tight. I feel like someone's going to hit you in the gut and you're contracting it. Pull the navel to the spine. Two more. And then we're all going to go down to a march. Okay. This is low end. Low kick, low kick, low kick. Everybody can do this with me. You can put on your own music if you want to. And just mute me out. I don't know if I would listen to music or not. I'm probably going to, but I'm not sure. Okay, this is a low kick. We're not doing anything high. But this is going to bring your intensity up if you feel too tired. If you're brand new, level one, walk it out. Don't ever just stop though, okay guys? Well, I don't want you to do is just stop because you're tired. At least, at least bounce your heels or move your hips or something, you know what I mean? Okay, back to the march for everybody. We're going to do that again with the knees and then the kicks. Five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, two. This is beginners today mostly, guys, but I will show some other if, if you want more. But I'm telling you, this is good. You're working your abs right here, your hip flexors. Okay. Okay, get your arms in there. You can add light weights if you want to, but I'm not going to add them in this today. Four more. Three more. Abs are tight, right? Two, you're breathing, don't hold your breath. Two, 
One more, march it out. Everybody march out. We're gonna set up for that low kick. No arms yet. Five, six, seven, eight, kick. And it doesn't really matter what leg you're on. I don't care. Mostly it's like you're moving. These turns are so long on me. All right, and kick, kick, kick. Okay, you wanna add an arm? If you do, and it will raise intensity a little bit. Whoa, we're just gonna add a tricep. Tricep. So work in the back of the arms. No weights. But if you don't just, when you start to get that arm warmed up, don't just fling them back like they're air. It puts against resistance. Like you're getting some resistance, resistance in the water. You're pushing back, pushing back, pushing back. This will help give you a nice contraction in the back of your arms. And ladies, you know you don't want jiggly triceps back of the arms. And eight, seven, six, five. I've got my palms forward, but you can also have them sideways, based on your legs. Eight, seven, I cheated, I'm going higher. I didn't cheat, but I lied, didn't mean to. Two more, and now back to March. We're gonna add a third component on here, and it's gonna work the hips and the thighs, okay? Again, feel free to just march it out. This is your safety zone right here. So march it wide. All right, no arms, we're gonna lift it out, out. I do a little bit of a squat in the center, but you don't have to, you can just do this, okay? But you wanna keep the abs tight. Okay, now if you want to add some arms, we're gonna add a punch, a straight punch. Three, four, palms are down, six, making a fist, eight. Don't ever push your fist so high, hard that you blood pressure can go up though. Never grab a weight so high that your blood pressure will go up. If you're feeling this in your thighs already and this is too much, tap, tap, or even not right here, okay? There's always, always options. There's no excuse not to be able to do these. Eight, seven, if you're doing these right, you're gonna feel it. Four, I feel it, and I work out my thighs all the time. I feel it. Back to the march. March it out. I forgot to time this. All right, this has been seven minutes. We're gonna go back to the knee lifts. Five, six, seven, eight, and knee. Two, three, four, one, two. Are your abdominals pulled in? Are you breathing? Think about always breathing out on the exertion we got. Four more. Three more. What's next is the kicks. Two more. Go right into a kick. All right. And the tricep. This is just a low kick. Don't worry, I'm coming back with something harder in a little bit. Eight. Seven. Six. Remember, you're using resist your own resistance with these triceps. Back of the arms. And two more. And last one. Let's go back to the march. Because I want to say something here. If you can see if you can you do a sentence like I'm talking, I'm breathless, but I'm still able to talk. If you're not able to talk, you're working out too hard and you need to take it down until you get your bearings back, okay? Get your strength back. What was the next thing we did? Oh yeah. Let's go ahead and march it wide. Okay. We're gonna tap, tap, tap. If you're very level one, you can stay right here. We're gonna add the arms and jab, 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 jab. If you want more, bring those legs up. Two. You can, if you're really tired, do a little bit of these and then go down to here if you need to, okay? Otherwise, keep it wide. Two, three, four. Keep your abs tight. We're gonna keep going right here. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Keep going. I know this is hard. Three, four, four more, and we're gonna march in place. Two, one, march it out, okay? We're gonna go like 10 minutes, okay? Now, we're gonna do a pump up. We're gonna really rev it up for beginners. Arms up, and now the knees are just gonna go one, two, abs in, okay? So we're not doing those marches in between. We're just doing legs, push, pull, abs are tight. Working the abs, 
working the cardio. You need strong immune system, especially nowadays, right? This is gonna help. Okay, we got four more of these. We're gonna amp it up, speed it up. Only if you're um, more advanced, okay? Four, three, two, march it out. If your back hurts, don't do those needles. Just keep it here. We're gonna go into the kicks. Now, here we go. Two, I'm speeding it up. Four, speeding it up. Because we're really gonna get those calories burned. I'm gonna be stopping this in a minute, so if you want more calories burned, do this about three to five, six times, okay? It's really not that hard. It doesn't take that long. All right, let's go. Eight more, seven, six. Feel free to bring the leg up a little bit higher, five. Four, three, two, one, march it out, march it wide, right into the outer hips and thighs, and a punch. I'm going to speed it up. Keep it slow if you want to. I'm speeding up because this is our last push. Now I have a cool down video in my playlist. Some stretching. Go ahead and go to that, and don't forget to stretch. Come on, let's go. Four, three, two, one. March it out. You did it. Beginners. That was hard. I'm breathing. Take a deep inhale. And exhale. Inhale up. Exhale. March it out. Let the arms just hang. Shake it out. Shake it out. Shake it out. Slow down the, slow down the march. Feel free to keep the march or just walk around the house. And then when your heart rate goes down, then you're going to stretch. So go to my cool down video, in my playlist, you'll find it. Um, you're going to want to do some front thighs. Go ahead and hang on to something. You're going to want to do some for the back of the thighs. You're going to want to do some for the back. So you're going to want to round it. And release it. Tucking the pelvis under. This is your pelvis is a bucket. Water comes out the back. Don't do just this many. Do this for like 10 minutes or so. Okay? Line your arms. We worked out triceps today. This is working out the back of the triceps. Okay? Don't forget to do this really slow down. We're done. Okay, I'm going to come back with a video that's going to be more intense. If this was your beginning, you have a good day.